Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to download and install Java JDK 20 in a Ubuntu operating system in any Ubuntu operating system with Java Home. It is a very easy video, so let's go. First, we go to the Java and just download Java JDK. Okay, first of all, we just go to any web browser and here just type Java JDK download or Java JDK. The first link is from the Oracle. It is an official website of Java JDK. Open that link. Okay, here is the our Java JDK. Here we find the latest version of Java. Now latest version is 20, so it is showing 20. Okay, now just scroll down. Okay, here we find JDK 20. Okay, here is the main operating system, Linux, Mac OS, and Windows. We are in the Ubuntu, so we just go to the Linux. In Linux, we just go to the x64 bit Debian package. We just go to the Debian package. We are just click at here this download link just click on the download link and our download is started at here or the bottom of the page depending on the your browser okay it takes some time so be a patient and wait for some time now our download is completed now just go to this show all or show all download just go to the show all download and just go to the folder that contain this download folder download file okay here is the our jdk file okay now just minimize minimize all now we check already we installed Java JDK or not. That is very easy. I just go to the here or just type Control Alt T on my keyboard or just go to the here and just go to the terminal. Okay, that is the second way. Okay, or just press Control Alt T. Okay, now here just type Java hyphen hyphen version and hit enter okay now java is not found you can easily install java from here but we want to install 20 20 is now now available not available on this installation okay now we just check java c is available or not java c then hyphen hyphen version just type hyphen hyphen version hit enter java c is also not found we just clear it okay now we are going to install it that is very easy first of all minimize it now i just go to the my folder once again here is the my download folder right click on this setup file right click on this setup file and just go with the open with other application just go with the open with other application and just click on the software install and just click on select okay now it takes some time and new window is launched now we just minimize it now here we find install button just click on the install here is the our jdk 20 and here is the our install just click on the install just add your password now it takes some time so be a patient and wait for some time now our software is successfully installed now just close it the next part is set a java path in ubuntu operating system that is very easy and simple First, we check Java version. So I just press Ctrl Alt T on my keyboard and terminal is open. Now in terminal, I just type Java version and hit enter. Okay. But Java home is not available because we are not set any path, Java path and Java home path to our PC or Java C path on our Ubuntu PC. That is very easy to set up Java path. So I minimize it and just go to the any folder or file and I just go to the other location computer in computer I just go to the user USR in USR LIB I just go to the LIB in LIB I just find GVM file I just find GVM file at here here is the GVM file double click on GVM file in GVM file we find JDK 20 just double click on JDK 20 in JDK 20, we find bin, just double click on bin. In bin, two files are most important, Java and Java C. Okay, these two files are most important. Now we want to copy the path of this folder or this folder or this file. Okay, that is very easy. Just press Ctrl L on your keyboard and your path is selected. Okay, or address is selected. Just right click on that and just copy it. Just right click on that and just copy it. Okay. Now I just queue some command in this fiction. Just go to the copy that commands. Okay. Okay. Here is the our first command sudo and the, this is the our second command. Okay. I give the path path 
just replace with this path to this new path okay and just copy this just copy this okay i just copy this uh, first of all just add java here just add java that is important okay and copy this and just go to the terminal in terminal right click on it paste it and just hit enter key. okay now it's ask for password just add your password okay now it is added now we just go to the next command and just replace with this bin sorry this path also with this path okay and just add java c just add java c just copy this path same thing copy it just go to terminal and paste it at here just paste it at here and hit enter key okay now just clear it the next step is we just check java c and java is available or not so just type java hyphen hyphen version hit enter now java 20 is available same thing with the java c just check java c is available or not just type java c hyphen hyphen version and hit enter and java c version is also available both are available so i just clear it okay now we are going to set up java home that is very also very simple first of all we just go to the, our command in command i just give this command three commands just copy the first command from sudo to environment we are going to the java environment okay just go to the terminal once again and paste it at here okay now it's open a new file it's open a new file at here now here we just add a some command or just add a some path so just enter it and just go to the new path new number it is a one number then just go to two or three or four depending on the your file and here just type just type at here java home we just type java underscore home then just type like this java underscore home all in capital equal sign double quote in this code just add this command okay i just close it so we can go to the file first and in file we just go to the our other location computer in computer usr lib just go to the lib in lib just find gvm just find gvm then jdk20 just go to the jdk20 and just control l on your keyboard and copy this part just copy this path okay now just go to the here and just add this path at here just add this path at here from this user to jdk20 just add this and we are going to the save this now just go to the here save just close save it okay now close it now just go to the your now just type ctrl alt on our keyboard okay and here we are going to refresh our environment path that is very easy we are going to the this command and paste this command at here source to environment and just hit enter it's refresh our java home or the environment file okay now we just type echo dollar sign java home underscore hit enter okay this shows us a path of the our java home now all things are successfully done now we successfully enter java path in our environment okay now close it now we are going to create a first java file and run that java file that is very easy first we just go to the here show application and just go to the text editor and create a new text editor okay or the new text file okay at here i just paste the my first java code and just save it i just go to save okay and here i just add any name we can add any name okay i just add my name you can add any name that you like okay 
and just type dot java dot java is imp i am saving it on the desktop you can save it on anywhere that you want i just double click on the desktop and i save this on the desktop okay now new file is created on the our desktop okay here is the our newly created abhi dot java file now we are want to run this GIF, uh, java file that is very easy and simple first we just go to the our terminal control alt t here is the our terminal now we want to go to the desktop that is very easy just type cd so i show you the simple way i just go to the file i just cancel it and i just go to the file i just go to the desktop just go to the desktop and drag this desktop to the our terminal now here is the our path it is automatically created now hit enter key now we are in the our desktop now we are going to run our java file that is very easy and simple just type java space then our file name okay a is capital and just type java and hit enter now we are see there is no error in our code it is just print hello java on our terminal so guys this is the simplest way to download install and just run our first code on our ubuntu operating system with java jdk 20. so guys thank you for watching this video don't forget to like share comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you guys